This is as far as we're going. Then it's far enough. Friendly? Trucks run out of gas. Oops. Run! She fires a bullet and it sounds like an arrow. Hmm. risks like this. And we can't just let people die, either. When I say that door stays shut no matter what, I fucking mean it. We don't know who these people are. They could be dangerous. Worse, they could have let them right to us. Where the hell is your humanity? Whoa, chill the fuck out, lady. We're just people trying to avoid those things, just like you. Don't come in here and swear at me. I'll say whatever <laughs> I want if you start threatening these I think people. swearing is the least of your You'll worries. You'll have to excuse her. The hell he or anyone will. This is about survival. Do you guys not see what's happening? What is it? I... I have to pee. I'd go out there again in a second. In a minute, Clem. They've got kids, Lily. Those things outside don't care. Maybe you should go join them then. You'll have something in common. God damn it, Lily. You have to control these people. Carly and Glenn just ran out there. I don't give a flying fuck. We're in a war zone. She's an asshole, that's for sure. That's what it takes. Well, you don't have to be a bitch about it. <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> Son of a bitch. One of them is bitten. He wasn't bitten. Hell, he wasn't. We have to end this now. Over my dead body, we'll dig one hole. No, I'm cleaning him up. There's no fight. He's fine. Don't you fucking people get it? We've already seen this happen. We let someone with a bite stay in, and we all end up bitten. Shut up. We gotta throw him out, or smash his head in. Kenny, stop him! Hey, what do we do about this guy? Dad, it's just a boy. It, it's... Lily, I'll handle it. We kick his ass. That's what I'm thinking. Everyone, chill the fuck out! Nobody is doing anything. Shut up, Lily. And you, shut the fuck up. They will find us, and they will get in here, and none of this will fucking matter. But right now, <laughs> he's swearing. She's not saying anything. With one of those things. What the hell are you talking about? He's bitten. That's how you turn. He's not bitten. Please stop this. It's upsetting him. Oh, I'm upsetting him. Upsetting is getting eaten alive. Dad, we get it. It's a big deal. Get Sit down. That's it. You're gonna whoop me? <laughs> you and one homo parade. This one. <laughs> That's good. <laughs> Oops. Before you eat your I don't mommy, think he thought about that before he answered. His nose broken. I'm gonna kill him, cat. <laughs> this homo parade's gonna stop to... you. Oh, wait. Lee. Yeah? yeah? There's someone in there. It's just locked. Keys behind the counter. Probably. Hey, I'm not the bad guy here. I'm just looking out for my daughter. No, you're just the guy arguing for killing a kid. He's covered in muck. She'll find the bite. Watch. She won't. And if she does, she doesn't look first like thing she's making do too is much sink progress. His teeth into his mom's face. Then, when she's dead, he'll probably pounce on your little girl. Then we deal with it then. But right now we're just freaking everybody out. Then get ready to deal with it because that boy is bitten. Not gonna happen. It is. And we're tossing him out now. Knock this guy out. Happily. Jesus. Oh man. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, Kenny got back up. Get away from her, you son of a 
Okay. Just great, thanks. Uh, guys. Everybody down. Stay quiet. They're gonna get in. Shut up. Is that the military? That sounds like automatic weapons fire. For whatever it is. We almost died because of this bitch and Richie trigger finger. That was stupid. That was uh, uh, Dad! Finally something to shut him up. Was he the one bitten? No. Don't be crazy. It's his heart. My pills. Um nitroglycerin pills? Yes, we're out. We've been trying to get into the pharmacy since we got here. Please try to get in there. Behind the counter where the pills are. There's probably another entrance. Maybe through the office. How do you know that's an office? Uh, educated guess. It doesn't matter. We need nitroglycerin pills. Please get in there. I'll keep an eye on my dad. Everyone else should get comfy and look for anything useful. We could be in here a while. I'm starting to think this drugstore isn't a permanent solution. You're right. This ain't exactly Fort Knox. What do you suggest? We need as much gas as possible so we can all get out of downtown Macon. Fast. Agreed. Then I'll head out and get gas. There's a motel not too far from here, out towards the end of Peachtree. I'll work my way towards it and then loop back, siphoning what I can. You know your way around? Local? Born and raised. If you're gonna do that, here's a walkie-talkie if you get in a tight spot. Hopefully, you won't need it. Cool. Clementine's got the other one. Check in with her and get back here as soon as you can. And you? What's your name? It's Lily. My dad's Larry. Keep a good eye on him. These boys will work on getting you your medicine. That's right. And you? You keep an eye on that front door. You're our lookout. It's Doug. You got it. And I'm Carly. Okay, Carly. You'll shift in with Doug when he needs it. For now, get some rest. You're a good shot, and I'd like to keep it that way. You got it, boss. Now get him those pills. Looks like nobody got a chance to donate anything before this all went down. Central High Take State. Paper's a week old. Feels like years. You're a pretty good shot. Well, you don't fuck with a reporter, especially one that's three days out from her last cup of coffee. <laughs> what are you messing around with there? A radio. I can't get it to work, though. Here, let me have a look. Uh, there are no batteries in batteries. this thing. <laughs> What now? <laughs> you know that there are no batteries in that thing. Yeah, of course. I, I mean, yeah. That's why it wasn't no. working, obviously. I try to find some. Needs two. Thanks. I wouldn't even really know what to look for. Heard or seen anything? Nothing, luckily. Wanna step outside, have a look around? <laughs> I'm not suicidal yet. No, the gate out there is closed. We can hang out in front of the store and be fine. Oh, huh. Sure. Let's go have a look around. Cool. Let's and do it. We'll keep it down. Don't need to bring them back this way with any unnecessary. Eh, forget noise. the guy's prescription Agreed. pills. We can do that later. I can tell him that's all we care about. And it won. No. 
gets you. They eat you. And whatever's left comes back as one of them. How the fuck? I think it might be more than a couple days before all this gets sorted out. Yeah. No kidding. I think so too. We better keep it down out of here. I can't reach that brick. Hey man, what are you doing? We can't even think about going out there unless the keys are out there for sure. Yeah, that's a hasty fortification job over there. Yeah, it didn't work. <laughs> Too bad we don't have a way to come out here and watch the news. Would be nice to know what's going on elsewhere. Atlanta's in rough shape, and that's all I know. Did you guys try to get in there and get weapons? I did, but it was too risky. And then a bunch of guys showed up and they tried. And what happened? I think they're most of who you see wandering around out there. Hmm. Look at the one trapped over there. Better hear uh, us, huh? Yep. Yeah, that's your brother. Oh, shit. What? Do you know that guy? Kind of. He has a familiar face. <laughs> oh, you're from around here, huh? Could be anybody, you know? They start rotting and get all chewed up and... Shut up, Doc. <laughs> Look at the uniform, though. He could have worked at the drugstore. And died with keys in his pocket. It would take a lot of effort to make it safe enough to go out there and see if he has the keys. If we could somehow prove that he worked here, I think it'd be worth it. I'll see what I can find. You know, now would be the time to just say that you know him and that's your family. How'd you end up here? I moved here to live with my uncle. He does tech stuff, and it just made sense. So you're local. You probably knew the owners of this place. No, not really. I've only been here a couple months, and I spend a lot of time... On the computer? No, just doing my own thing. Hey, that's a stereotype. Hmm. I knew some folks here. Seemed like as good a place as any. Oh. Friends? Family? They around? Family, but it doesn't seem like it. Do you think we're safe here? Well, I haven't been able to get through this gate so far. And the drugstore's safe enough, I think. Whoever owned it took us. <laughs> One peculiar thing about this well. little segment here is that uh, he says, let's see, I found this remote in the office, but we haven't even gone into the office yet to get the remote so they uh, they screwed up on that part loophole so I'm gonna wait until we actually go in the office and get the remote before we you know start messing with it but uh, what's everyone like in there oh well Carly's pretty nice you know <laughs> yeah Lily doesn't take any crap she's been running the show keeping people on watch things like that Dad. Yeah, that guy. He's kind of a dick. Pardon my French. All right, going back inside. Let's head back inside. Okay. By the way, I don't think it breaks anything in the game if you go ahead and tell him that you found the remote. It just acts as if you already had it. So, uh, in fact, I did that on my last playthrough. No, I'm sorry to hear your loved one was eaten by the living dead guards. Got us a battery. We can't let anything happen to Ducky. I know, hon. 
I don't remember them very well. It's all melted now. Hey, Lee. Maybe punching him wasn't such a good idea. <laughs> there were worse plans. Says the guy who didn't get punched in the mouth. <laughs> anyway, we, Kat and I, appreciate your support. Thank you, Lee. I was stuck to it. It's okay. It was just a shock. We're lucky as hell nobody got nabbed on the way in here. No kidding. How's she doing? She's good, I think. She's a tough one right there. She's just a little girl, Ken. What were you saying, Lee? She spent days surviving on her own? That's right. Not just any little girl can do that. Are you guys all right? Oh, we're just fine, considering. How about you, Duck? We've all been through a lot. What's the plan? Hang tight, I suppose. Seems pretty dangerous out there, so we ought to wait for things to clear up. You said your family was from here in Macon? That's right. Where are they? Should we go looking for them? <laughs> they, uh, own this place. They're gone. Oh, sweetie. Cat. They were good people. I wasn't around much, but yeah, they're dead. Lee, you got a second? Sure. <laughs> Back on Herschel's farm. Yeah. We didn't even try to save him. That blood is on our hands, you know? Well, you didn't try to save him. Save him. It happened pretty fast. I guess. But I can't stop seeing him in my head. We can't kill ourselves. Over we him. killed that boy. We could have saved him together. We did what we could. Bad things happened. We didn't make a choice that killed Sean. You think you do when you look back on it, but in a moment, when things are really out of control, you don't have any choice. I guess. Try to let it go. How's it doing? I'm not sure I got your name. It's Lee. Lily. My dad's Larry. I was just doing what I had to earlier. Everyone was. You didn't have to call me a bitch in front of my people. I don't need that shit, all right? It's hard <laughs> enough to be in charge of people's lives without some dick cutting you down. And that violence before with my dad, that didn't help. Yeah, well, your dad's a jerk. What's wrong with him? He's got a heart condition. He takes nitroglycerin tablets pretty regularly. I've seen a few bad attacks that he couldn't get over and needed to go to the hospital. Yeah, that's uh, not really an option right now. I'm just trying to keep him relaxed. You're from here? I work at Warner Robins, the Air Force Base. Yeah, I know it. Pilot? Nah, just mechanical admin stuff. I deal with a bunch of shitheads and bureaucrats all day. Sometimes a plane, if I'm lucky. You? I work up at UGA. Was anyone here when you guys got here? No, this place was pretty wrecked. We pulled a couple of bodies out of the office. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. Did you know anybody here? Yeah, the owners, they were, uh, we were close. I'm sorry. We found an older couple in the office. Dad hauled them out in case they weren't really dead. He's got a temper. Ah, oh, fuck you. <laughs> yeah, he Thank does. you for proving my point. It's just that... Yeah? Never mind. I'm 
sure he's a good guy. He is. He just has his issues. Where's her mom? Savannah, I think. Oh, you guys aren't together. Oh, uh, no, I'm not her dad. I found her in a house when getting out of Atlanta. She'd been surviving by herself. I think the girl's parents didn't make it. Oh. I heard an answering message. They were in Savannah. She was home with a sitter. It wasn't good. Well, she's lucky to have you. What do you think about all this? What is there to think? The dead are up, walking around, eating people, and turning them into more... more of them. I mean, Jesus. We need to stick together and get through this. I'm gonna get back to him now. Okay, okay. 